Okay. I have chocolate. I'm ready to go. I, I feel like this one's gonna be rough. Um, in terms of me being sad. Like, hopefully I'm wrong, but they've laid the groundwork for this one because we found out a lot about Sue just like through playing the game. So I'm a little bit scared. Let's do this. <laughs> Hmm. I'm not ready. Okay. Now it's, you know, turning on the screen would be helpful. <laughs> okay. Let me get into a comfortable position for reading lots of words. Okay. So last time, we helped um, Kisabudo, and we met up with, is this, is it Ume? Or Uma, I forget, but uh, I think it's Uma. And he told us about the, uh, the way to turn off the pumps. And he was like, hey, if you need to turn off the pumps somewhere, or like you need to remove some water from someplace, maybe you should do this. So I did it, and then I thought, of course, we can use this to reach Sue, who was over here behind a waterfall the whole time. I know she's waiting for me. I feel so bad. Oh, no, 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 come back. Sue, wait. I wish I could remember where we were supposed to meet. Wow, is this, this is giving me to the moon vibes. But I can't remember much of anything anymore. She was counting on me. Who was counting on you, Sue? My friend. She needed someone to take care of her. She didn't have anyone to take care of her. She didn't have anyone to love her. I promised that we'd take care of each other. But I broke that promise. I have to find her. We'll find your friend, Sue. I promise. Thank you. Uh-oh. She dropped this. What do you think it's for, Mom? Mm, I'm not sure. But when I was a little girl, I used a ribbon with a bell on it just like this as a pet collar. A pet collar? Oh, is it not a person? Yep. The noise from the bell helped us find our cats and dogs when they were hiding. And it made them harder it made it harder for them to catch birds and mice. Mm. Mom, look! It says Poochie on the side. <gasps> oh! The dog! That name seems familiar received Poochie's bell. Oh, okay. Well, before I... Hang on. I want to go see if she's in here first. Oh, she's in here all by herself. We need to bring her her dog. I wish I could remember where we were supposed to meet. She was counting on me. We'll find your friend, Sue. I promise. Thank you. Alright. Well, we know where her friend is, actually. No wonder the puppo looked so sad. Okay, well we, I guess we'll just go get the doggo and bring it back here. Oops. All right, now how do I get there from here? How, how can I do that? Not quite sure I remember. So her friend isn't a person at all, it's a dog. I think I can go down this way, right? I think I can cut. Oh wait, oh, oh. Look, oh no, 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 this is how I get there. Cause I, this is where the dragon is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I can cut through here. Yes, the best music. Actually, I think I've said like 10 songs, the best music, so. Doggo, Poochie, mom, look. She's sniffing the bell we picked up back there. Are you Sue's friend? Do you want us to take you to her? I think she wants to follow us. Aw, she seems like such a sweet dog. We'll take you back to your friend, little one. Yay, mom, let's go. Oh my god, we have a dog party. Oh my god, look how cute this dog is. This dog is so cute. It's a very realistic looking dog with, with the wings, honestly. It's so cute. 
I love this dog. All right, let's take this dog back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. So getting some slowdown. All right. I would, okay, whoa, whoa. Things are getting a little wild. I would, I need to stop going this way. I cannot get around the tree. All right. Now if we take the dog to Sue, I doubt it will be this easy, but this could start something, maybe. Sue, Sue, we found your friend. We found Poochie. Oh, she's gone. Um, Sue? Mom, where did she go? I'm not sure, dear. What do you think, Poochie? Do you know where she went? <gasps> I just adore her. Wow, Poochie. Thanks. Oh, we get to keep the dog. Yes. Okay, perfect. All right, now we're... Oh, no. Is that... Are things going to get creepy again? I don't know if I'm ready for things to get creepy. Oh? Oh, cats! Oh, I'm a dog! I'm Poochie! But aren't you hungry? I am, but you know I can't go home right now. Well, okay. But just don't catch a cold. It's getting chilly these days. I'll try my best. See you later, Yuki. Hi. Can I talk to you? It's pretty tough for us strays when the weather starts turning cold. I think it might snow soon. Keep warm, pup. I'm, well, I'm not sure exactly where I'm going. Store's closed. Oh, no. Excuse me, I'd like to cross. I can't. Okay, never mind. Oh, look, there's another stray. Okay. Hey. Toma. Sorry, pup. Can't let you pass. Oh, he's so cute. Wait. Hmm? You're new around here, aren't you? Where's your litter? Where's your ma? I don't know. I just woke up this morning and they were all gone. Oh, I'm sorry, kid. Well, how about this? If you're looking for a warm place to sleep, prove to me you're a good pup. Bring me something to eat and I'll let you sleep in the alley back here. The hot water pipes run directly through it, so it's nice and warm. Good company, too. All the nice cats and dogs hang out back there. Cats and dogs hang out together? Of course, so this time we strays gotta stick together. Cat, dog, it don't matter. Deep down, we all just want a warm bed, a full tummy, and someone to love us. So it's a deal, huh? Bring me some food and you can join us. I'll try my best. Okay, can we go? Oh, hang on. We've got a car arriving. Oh, is the store open now? Do we have to go steal some food? This just looks like a 7-Eleven. Oh, Looney, why didn't you come home last night? Everyone told me that I shouldn't let you be an outdoor cat because it's too dangerous in the city. But I wanted you to be free. Oh, hello there, doggy. Bark. Me? Oh, I'm just really worried right now. My cat, Looney, she usually comes home every night, but last night she didn't return. I had to come to work today, but I'm just worried sick. What if something happened to her? What if she's lost? You probably can't understand what I'm saying. Well, doggy, I'm so sorry, but I can't let you stay inside. My boss has a strict no dog policy, so it's not safe for you here. Please take care, little one. Okay, well maybe if we can bring him his cat, he'll get us some food. Hey, Looney, you're back. Come on in. <gasps> Wait. I need that cat. God, look at how cute this little Shiba is. 
Hey pup, did you find any food? Not yet. Say, who was that cat who just followed you into the alley? You mean Looney? Real sweet black cat. Bright yellow eyes. She's actually not a stray. She's a really nice owner and lives in the apartments around here. But she's still hanging with us. That's rare, you know? Most domestics don't want to mess with our kind, but Looney's different. I know I don't have any food for you yet, but would it be alright if I went to the alley just for a bit? I have a message for Looney. It's about her owner. He okay? He's really worried about her. I guess she didn't come home last night. Hmm. Okay, you seem like an honest pup. I'll let you back there just for a bit to talk to Looney. Thank you. Yes, we have access. Looney's the black cat right up there. Go ahead and deliver your message. I'll wait here for you. Wait, I wanna to talk to everyone first. Oh, don't go. Hi. Hello, Looney. I am, um, well, I just saw your owner and um, he seemed really, really worried about you. He said you didn't come home last night. Oh no, I was afraid he'd worry. You see, I don't usually stay away from home for this long, but it was an emergency. My best friend's owner passed away, so he's really sad and needs my company right now. Oh, Looney, I don't want your owner to worry. You've already been such a great help to me during this time. You should go back to him. I'll be fine now. Kenny, are you sure? I'm sure. I think I need a nap now anyway. I'll come back every day, just as I always do, because you're my best friend. You're my best friend too, Looney. Oh my god, this is so cute. Thank you for letting me know about this. Do you think you could take me to my owner? Okay. Oh, so you made a new friend. Ready to head out? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Alright, now we have two cat- and we have two pets. Alright, excuse me? Yeah, I brought you your cat. Doggy, I'm really sorry, but I can't let you- Looney! Looney, is that you? Oh, kitty sound. Oh, Looney, I thought something awful had happened to you. Is this doggy your friend? Thank you for bringing my cat back to me. I'm so relieved she's okay. Come here, I've got something for you. To say thank you, why don't you have some of this fish cake? Yes, fish cake. Take care, little one. Perfect, now we can give it to this cat who is blocking our entrance. Oh my goodness, that heavenly scent. Is that a fish cake? You can have it if you like. Yay. I hope you enjoy it. We're gonna enjoy it together. Come on, pup, you're one of us now. Aww. Hi, Paul. That isn't just some boring dude with a beard talking. Well, girl, you've been on the wrong part of Twitch. How are you? Tonight we have a very special treat. Courtesy of our new friend, Poochie. Is that fish cake? Fish cake! Oh, look at these cats. And I must say, Champ, you did an amazing job as well. The baker's wife gave me all their leftovers because I ate a squirrel that was destroying her garden. Bravo. There are enough donuts here to start our own bakery. A cat and dog bakery, that'll be the day. Welcome to the first official Tokyo cat and dog bakery. Ha ha ha. Okay, everyone, let's eat. Oh, we have so many friends now. It is fancy, thank you. Oh, is that, is that her? No, that's not her, Never mind. Where is that dog? Uh-oh. The boss wife should be right by the elementary school. Let me check the orders again. <gasps> oh no. There she is! Get her! No! Run! Oh, there's Sue. Okay, pup, you're coming with us now. She's awfully calm for a stray, isn't she? Yeah, she's a nice dog. It's a shame no one will adopt her. 
too mangy, too mangy. Is that how you pronounce that word? I think so. Such a forlorn look on her face. Yes, we are the dog, uh, right now. So, it, how this game works is like we're, we're trying to help people and we're kind of going through like their memories, but usually we're someone, uh, like peripherally related. Like, uh, in the last one we were, the, I think the guy's like wife. Um, and now we're trying to help this girl right here. Um, her name is Sue. And I think we're, we are taking the part of her dog. Kind of reminds you of Hachiko, doesn't she? Oh, Hachiko! That's a good call out. Huh, <laughs> you're right. A big mangy Akita like Hachiko wouldn't last too long in today's Tokyo. Such a shame. They'll probably put her down in seven days like all the others. Oh, wait! You can't put her down? Oh, I'm sorry, little girl. I know it sounds really sad, but there's just too many stray dogs and not enough homes. Why are you always killing dogs? No, I mean, you can't put her down because... Because... Because she's my dog. She's your dog? I love this song so much. When was the last time I killed a dog on stream? Yes? Um, also, I'm not killing this dog. We're saving this dog. What's her name? When did I stream Life is Strange? I don't remember that. I believe you, but... Her name... Her name is Poochie. Maybe that was on YouTube. Um, are you thinking of, uh, The Walking Dead? Maybe that was a thing. Oh, Artie! Hello! Thank you so much for the raid! Tony Trounced. Wait, were you playing backyard baseball again? Because that game was like my childhood, and I keep seeing you say that you're streaming it, and I've been meaning to like come. Um, I literally spent hours of my childhood playing that game. <laughs> you have colorful Artie and colorful Marty. Backyard baseball is just a great game. Anyways, thank you so much for the raid. My countermeasures are still kind of broken. Um, but I appreciate you, and welcome, uh, to the stream. We are playing this cute little dog. Her name is Poochie. Poochie! Poochie, did you sneak outside again? I told you to stay in the yard. I see. And where is Poochie's collar? Oh, um... Well, you see, she keeps taking it off because it's too tight. Mom's been meaning to get her a new one, one that fits, but she works full time, so she's really busy. It went out of play after hitting Tony. Oh my god. Man, I used to have- god, this is backyard baseball is a game. I miss that game. Honestly, I want to play backyard baseball again. Okay, but please be careful that your fence is dog-proof next time. If the dog gets out, it's very dangerous for people as well as for the dog. I understand, sir. It won't happen again. Keep an eye on her. I will, sir. I promise. God, this dog is so cute. Phew, that was a close one. Okay, so for those of you who are coming in and may want to stay, this game is called Rakuen. It's uh, a visual novel by Laura Shigihara, who did uh, the music for games you may know, like To the Moon and Finding Paradise. Um, and the basic story is that we are playing a boy uh, who has been in the hospital and his mother. And we just found out that the magical storybook land of our dreams uh, is real. And we want to obtain a wish from the forest guardian. Um, but he's asleep. I mean, to wake him up. But uh, by learning a song, which means we need to make people happy. So we've made three people happy and we're on number four out of five total. Um, and I feel like this one's gonna be a sad one today, so, uh, be prepped. I can't believe they're gonna put you down! Such a nice and beautiful dog like you, I just couldn't let that happen. Doggo! Mom and Dad would never let me keep a dog as a pet. But that doesn't mean we can't be friends. Oh, you must be so hungry. I actually have some leftovers from lunch that you can have. But we should probably go someplace safer. Come on, I have just the place. 
Oh. Okay, Poochie. Today I want to show you my favorite place. See this tree? I call it the lonely tree. Why do I call it that? We're not gonna kill the dog. Well, it's all by itself. It's too tall to talk to the grass. It doesn't have a whole lot in common with the bushes. There just aren't any other trees here. It needs someone to talk to. Oh, don't worry. The tree isn't lonely when I'm here, and I come here a lot. It's my favorite place. When it's hot, the tree gives me shade. When I'm scared, it lets me hide in its branches. We talk together and just hang out. It's nice, you know? Anyways, since I walk by here every day after school, do you want this to be our meeting place? I'll save part of my lunch for you. And we can play games together. How does that sound? Oh, this is so cute. It's a deal then. I gotta go home now, but... Here's some food for you. I wasn't that hungry today, so there's a lot left. Hope you enjoy! Oh, she's so good. See you tomorrow, Poochie! She's so good. I didn't know, man. I thought her friend was gonna be a person. Okay, Poochie. Now it's my turn to hide. <laughs> They're kind of sick. Close your eyes. Oh, no. Are they closed for reals? Okay then, count to ten. One, two, three, four, five. You're never gonna find me. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I know, the dog is so cute. And the dog in Raku and like in the storybook world, it looks like this but is white and has little wings. And it's the cutest thing. Okay, we have to find her. Uh, okay. Is she in here? Is she inside this house? Ha! Found you! I knew you would be in there. You found me! Now it's your turn to hide. Okay. Do I have to actually hide? Oh no. Tell us about your marbles, Sue. Oh no, they're gonna be mean? Oh, these girls are bitches. Um, so Sue is currently also in the hospital with us. Um, we don't know exactly what is wrong with her. Um, or like what her diagnosis is. But throughout the course of the game, we've been finding her marbles all over the place. And she tells us stories about them, like that they're little worlds. And that's literally the cutest thing. Like, I literally love her so much. And now these, these girls are about to be real mean and I'm gonna get real sad. Haha, <laughs> yeah, Sue. Tell us how you actually think they're little planets. She thinks they're planets? Haha, <laughs> yeah? I don't want to take them out of the jar right now. Why? Will all the little aliens spill out? Ha ha ha. She's such a weirdo. I don't like taking them out at school. No. You don't want to take- oh my god. Whoa, what's that? What's happening? Blue Spider, thank you so much for the donation. Reach point bedtime, have a fantastic stream. Love you and everyone in chat. Thank you so much. You did not have to do that. I appreciate it. I hope you have a great sleep. Good night. They're not just marbles. So she admits it. She thinks her marbles are planets. She's crazy. Ha <laughs> ha. Leave me alone. Come on, Sue. Let us see your planet. Get away from me. Oh, poaching to the rescue. Doggo. Ah! Get your scary stray dog away from us. Aw. <laughs> nope, I, I enjoy streaming. It's fun. Oh, Poochie. Thank you. People don't always like you when you're different. Maybe it's just how it is, like how cats and dogs don't get along. What's that, Poochie? You used to hang out with cats and they wanted to start a dog and cat bakery? Oh my god, could she actually understand the dog? 
Wow, that's really cool. I needed a place like that. Oh my god, I hope she gets out of the hospital and starts a dog and cat bakery. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, Peter Rabbit-esque. Poochie, today I want to show you where I live. No, Poochie. Sorry, girl. It's just that you can't bark around here or we could get in trouble. Okay, quiet. Thanks for understanding. Well, this is my home. I really wish I could show you my room, but Dad's home right now. He gets pretty angry if he's napping and someone wakes him up. He came home last, late last night because he was out playing this grown-up game. You know, the kind of game where you drink grown-up drinks and lose a lot of money. We have heard that her dad has a gambling problem. I don't like those games. But don't worry. I still have lots of cool things I can show you in the yard. Like, see over here. Earlier this year, some morning doves made a nest in the bushes. See how low to the ground it was? I came and checked on them every morning before school. And one day, the babies flew away. Oh. Oh, this is so sad. Where did I put it? Here it is. See how much this rock looks like a duck? What the hell is this? Calm down, dear. I needed to wash your clothes. I... Oh, no. I told you not to move my things. Dad's awake. Come on, Poochie. We gotta go. Follow me. Oh, no. This is so sad. They've all been sad, but, like, this is a whole new sad. Quick, Poochie, in here. That was close. We can hide here until things calm down. Oh, we're inside the house. Wanna look at my marble collection? Hell, yes. I don't have the whole jar with me, but I have a few new ones in my pocket. We're gonna help her. It's okay. When I have to hide, I like to choose a marble and make a new world. Will you make a new world with me, Poochie? Let's see, how about this one? I found this marble at the base of the lonely tree and it's the color of amber. It made me think the tree was giving me a present. I think this planet has a really big tree in it. The tree is so big that everyone lives there together. I think she's told us about this one before. Inside the tree, there's a room where flower creatures serve you the most delicious tea ever. And the tea room is upside down so you can walk on the ceiling. Your tea won't even fall out of the cup. Of course you can sit at the table with me and share my food. Yeah, I think I do think she has told us this one. You want to make up another world? Oh, this is going to be all the ones that we've given her back. Okay, what will yours be like? A cat and dog bakery planet. That's a great idea. Oh, I know. I think so, too. And I remember saying that when we first started, like, talking to her. I was like, honestly, this sounds like something I would have done as a kid. Like, I... Yeah, I, I vibe. I vibe. Oh, no, she looks sad. I'm not ready. Are you okay, honey? I think she needs a hug. Give her a hug. Gucci. He left. Oh, no. He just took all his things, and now he's gone. He didn't even say goodbye. Oh, honey. Poochie. Do you think he was a bad person? Do you think he left because he didn't care? Was he afraid? Did he not love us anymore? It's okay. Poochie. I made you something today. It's your very own collar. I used pink ribbon and a bell I got from school. That way everyone will know that you have someone who loves you and wants to take care of you. I'll always be there for you, Poochie, I promise. Oh, I don't think the collar is gonna be long enough. 
That's okay, I have more ribbon at home, so I can fix it later. Okay, Poochie, I gotta go early today. Gotta help Mom with some stuff. But I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, Poochie. You're my best friend. Oh, doggo. Oh no, not something bad, something worse is gonna happen. Oh, he jump. Or she, I think Poochie's a girl, actually. Oh no. Mm hmm? Oh. Hey. Thanks for the follow. Why were you not following me before? <laughs> Way to ruin this sad moment with the blue badger dance. Nicely done. Oh no. Oh no, they're moving. I can't go yet, Mom. I have to talk to my friend. I know moving is a scary thing, but trust me, Sue. You'll make new friends. I don't want to make new friends. Hi, Jazz Girl. Thank you for lurking. Enjoy. This is my best friend. And she needs me. I can't just leave her. I don't understand why we have to move away. Can't I just go to the doctor here? We're going to Sendai to stay with your uncle and our aunt because it's closer to the kind of medical care you need. Sue, so I know it's difficult. But your father's not here anymore. Practically speaking, it's just too expensive for us to live here. Then can I bring my friend with me? For the last time? No. Now please, Sue, get in the car. Oh no. Poochie, I'm so sorry. Wait, are they just leaving those boxes there? Is that not their stuff? Oh no, it is like Hachiko. It, it, it literally is Hachiko. Whoa, okay. We're, things are weird. Mom, where are we? I'm not sure, sweetie. It feels cold and really empty. I know, dear. It's probably best if we keep walking. Okay. Can I look at things on the way? No. Oh, we still have Poochie with us, though. We still have Rockwood and Poochie. We just- we needed to take Poochie to Sue. Oh, there's Uma. Uma? What are you doing here? I failed her. Who? I don't know why I'm still here, boy. After all the bad things I've done, I don't deserve to still be walking these paths. Is this her dad? I had a life. I had a vice. Maybe I didn't know what I had at the time and I ran away from my problems in the most cowardly way a man can. I think this is her dad. They needed me. Sue needed me, so now I spend my days wandering these worlds in hopes that I can find something, anything, to make this pain go away. Doggo, look how cute Poochie is, holy shit. Did you take care of her while I was away? You took care of each other. She's strong, isn't she? Maybe you can't change the past, but you can still do something for her, Uma. What's that? Let her know that you love her and that you always did, even when it didn't seem that way. Thank you, boy. Well, I think the time has come for me to cross these worlds. It's been a real pleasure. Goodbye. Oh, is he taking Poochie? What's gonna happen, though? Oh. Oh. He's going to see her. Oh, is he gonna sing? Is he gonna sing a song? 
Is already time for the song? That was way too fast. If this is the song. Gucci? Poochie! Oh, Poochie, I'm so sorry for leaving you. I remember now. You waited for me by the tree near our old home. I wanted to meet you there. I wanted to so badly. Thank you for understanding, girl. I'll never leave you again. Oh, because she was waiting by a tree. In Rockwood, too. I promise. <gasps> Is it time for song already? Oh no, everyone get ready. Song time. did it oh god that was so fast wait goodbye sue oh no he didn't even say anything no oh well now what we got room stuff and friendship we only have one more hey what's up danielle what's going on you guys are still here hi danielle since you're still here, you should come join us for Star Night tonight. Thank you. What's Star Night again? Ugh, only the biggest celebration of the whole year. It's basically the best, trust me. Okay. When it's time for Star Night, talk to the chief and he'll walk over with you. See you soon. Oh man, is it time? Like... Are we finishing this tonight? Like, we can't stop now. Like, that would be silly. I wonder where they are now. I hope we can find them. It's only been 40 minutes. We can't stop now. We gotta do something else. Oh, it is nighttime now. I didn't notice that before. Oh, it is actually probably time for, for the festival. I guess we could at least see that. Oops. Nope, nope. Yeah, everyone's... The stars are starting to fall, you know what that means. Star Night's about to begin. Shall we walk to the festival together? Yeah, let's do it. Alrighty then, let's go. Oh, this is so cute. Mom, I can't believe we're really here. It's truly amazing. What a beautiful festival. What would you like to do first, dear? Hey. Welcome to Star Night. Is it your first time here? What am I saying? Of course it's your first time here. Well, come on in, make yourselves at home. Oh, and here's a little gift. We call it Liebel Ramune. Hell yeah. It's a delicious bubbly drink in a fun glass bottle. I love Ramune. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my God, he's got a little Ramune bottle. Oh, that's so cute. Whoa, mom, look. There's a little glass marble inside the top of the bottle. Oh, how neat. I love Ramune. I need more Ramune. When I was a little girl, we used to drink Ramune. A neighborhood boy once told me there was a way to get the marble out of the bottle. Someone else reading? Oh, someone else followed too. Wait, oh my God, there's so many things happening. Ooh, boy, thank you so much for the follow. All right, I'm gonna assume this is a raid because uh, Twitch apparently won't won't uh, tell me about small raids anymore, but I appreciate your small raid. Welcome. Look at this graph. Oh gosh, what were you playing? That could be anything. That's just a meme. I assume it was Westerford's raid, but thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Welcome. Fortune Street. Oh, love Fortune Street. Good times. 
That is that is a good place to say, look at this graph. Welcome, we're playing some Rockwin, and it's time for Star Night. It's a very cute festival where we're drinking Ramune. But I'm pretty sure he just made that up. No, I've also heard that there's a way to do that. Mom, I think I should give this marble to Sue. Okay, that's A, really cute, and B, kind of gross. Do you think she'd still want it for her collection, even though it's inside a bottle? That's very kind of you, dear. And yes, I'm sure she would very much appreciate that. Okay then, let's go to Star Night. Oh my god, we have so many people to talk to! What a beautiful night! I love checking out all the different treats they have during Star Night. Do you have a favorite? I'll tell you your fortune based on which one you choose. Um, I love takoyaki. Takoyaki are delicious. The one problem is I get too excited and bite into it before it's cooled down. If you eat takoyaki fast like me, then it means you need to work on your patience. Me. But if you're waiting for it to cool, it means you're good at savoring life. Oh, that's cute. Wait, I want to I wanna do all of them now. Watermelon's my favorite fruit. When I was little, my mom said I kind of looked like a watermelon. Is that good? If you like watermelon, it means you're easygoing and laid back. Hmm, well actually, if the reason you're eating it is because you got really angry and need to cool off, then the opposite is true. Alright, I think you can tell me nothing, my dude. I love these little mini Morius. They're so cute. Dongo are so chewy. I think if you like them, this means that you persevere. You have to chew a lot to finish one. That's fair. What if I say I can't choose? Because that's the real answer. I don't blame you. I wish Starnet came around more than just once a year. Right, let's talk to everyone. Hi. When I hear this music, I can't help but sway back and forth. Well, you keep at it, my dude. Shaved ice with fun flavors. Get them before they melt. Oh, oh is this a goldfish game? Oh, it's Winston. Try our hand at King Yosuke. Su wait. Let me try that again. If you can catch a goldfish, you can keep it as a pet. Would you like to play? Yeah. Okay, here's your paper net. Good luck. Did I get one? Did I get it? Sorry, you didn't catch anything. Better luck next time. What? No. Alright, I'm gonna keep doing this. Oh, I got one. You got a goldfish. Now you have your very own pet. Heck yeah. Alright. Have you tried midnight tea before? It's a very special kind of tea that makes you dream the sweetest dreams you've ever had. Oh, is it Sugar Baby? You guys are here! I missed you a lot! Rupert misses you too, even though he doesn't want to admit it. Haha. <laughs> oh, everyone is here. This is so nice. Fish. Mmm. Okay, let's talk to everyone. Tea balls. Nothing goes with cream cake like a nice hot cup of tea. Does this one say something? Yeah. Honey melon of the finest quality. What do you want? Okay, rude. Um, hi guys, thanks so much for helping me with the lanterns earlier. This place looks great. What's up? What you doing? Painting portraits for folks and face paint for the kids. Uh, what's the best thing here? Mm, I really like the styleberry donuts over at Panky's. They're delicious. Cool. Let's do. No, 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 no. Oh God. No, 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 no. There we go. Okay. I keep accidentally talking to her. I, girl, I love you, but you gotta chill out. This tea is delicious. Alice, Alice, do you wanna know what I've eaten tonight? Please tell me you aren't gonna get sick later. I had an eclair, a fruit tart with whipped cream, a sandwich, another sandwich, a pie, a... I thought you said you were gonna pace yourself. Wait, does pace yourself mean eat until your stomach hurts? Oh my gosh, no. Oh, then no, I'm not going to pace myself. All right, good for you. So Dean, tell me about work today. Well, work was pretty good. I had to, Oh, look, Alice, it's pie. Yes, there's salivary pie over there. You had some, remember? Oh, sorry, okay, so at work today, I was helping to fix. Look, there's a firefly. Yes, they're everywhere. Go on, you were telling me about work. Oh my gosh, sorry. Okay, so I was helping a customer today at work and, Alice, you have ears. Is he drunk? What? Of course I do. Why would you be surprised? But oh, never mind. I love this game. It's so funny. Okay, let's let's talk to everyone. It's the best start night ever. Oh, that's all they say. 
They're just dancing. Here's the band. Oh, yes, no holds barred. Plays festivals, too. Little buds in the house. Let's get this party started. Got any requests? Do a loot solo. Hell yeah. That was dope. Oh, here's uh, Kazuko's here. You made it. I'm so happy to see you here. I brought many different teas to share with folks tonight, but the most special tea of all, as you know, is our midnight tea. What's it like? Well, it tastes sweet, though there's no sugar will make you feel cozy and warm as if you were at home. But the real reason it's so special is that after drinking it, you'll have the sweetest dreams you've ever had. Care to try some? Although I must warn you, once you drink it, you'll surely fall asleep. That seems like the last thing I should do, so I'm not gonna do that yet. Oh, it's Sugar Baby's cousins. Long time no see, friends. It's a beautiful night, but this humidity is terrible for my powered wig. Let's actually clear this side out first. Oh, here's uh, Jackie. Glad you could make it. We're gonna make such a big part of the village. It'd be weird not to see you here. What can I do for you? What are you doing? I'm taking a break, of course. Actually, I'll tell you guys what I'm really doing. I'm secretly studying the science behind festival games. Science behind games? Let's just say the chief decides to bring out a bean tossing game. Check this out. If you flatten the bean bag before you toss it, you have a greater chance of knocking more things over. It's nothing more than maximizing surface area. I've got this in the bag. The bean bag. Okay, thank you. I would say the bread, except Panky is not baking it correctly. He isn't using the right ratio of flour to leavening agents, so the optimal bread height has not been achieved. But bread height aside, the bread is very good. Too good. I love this game. All right, let's talk to everyone. Want to eat some takoyaki? They're piping hot, chewy, and delicious. Hell yes, I love takoyaki. Hey, glad you make it. Where's your husband? Ugh, he couldn't make it tonight. He's playing some dumb card game with one of his bear friends. Super Dragon Mage Wizard Warrior Wizards or something. Oh my god, did you ever get a fifth cat? I got something even better, actually. Her name is Peach. Hey, oh, wait, what? You're in luck, my plushies were selling like hotcakes, but... My hotcakes were selling like plushies! I... Thank you. As I was saying, I'm nearly sold out, but I have one very special plushie left. It's yours for the low, low price of 10G. Would you like to buy it? Aw, yeah! Oh my god, it's him. Go, Grandpa, you can do it! Oh, is he having like an eating contest? Does that tiny Lee really think he can beat a bear in a pancake eating contest? Ha, I'm a bear! Is it this guy? Oh, it's this, oh, it's this, the fat one. Oh, so that bear thinks he can beat me at eating pancakes? Well, ask him this, did he ever eat so many pancakes they had to carry him away in a stretcher? Because that was me the last three years. Oh no. Well, finally got everything prepared in time. These guys are about to have a pancake eating contest. All right, good. The chief is telling us about the blue star. Oh, well that sounds important. Buff because he's gonna eat everything, just you wait. Chief tells good stories with lots of exciting t secrets and twists. But when I listen to his stories with my ma, she just can't help herself. If she heard the story before, she always reveals the ending before the chief has a chance to get to that part. Oh no. This is the good part. You find out that the villain wasn't actually a bad guy at all. He was just her long lost nephew in disguise the whole time. Ma, why are you always giving away the endings? Oh, I just wanted to make sure you understood because it's kind of complicated. But he hasn't even gotten to that part yet. Sorry. Oh no, spoilers. Who, me? Oh, I always leave the caves to hear the chief's stories. Okay, let's see if he's got a story for us. If you're enjoying Star Knight. No? Okay, fine. He apparently isn't going to tell us the story. Is that everything, then? Now we just need to drink the tea? Alright, fine. Yeah, I guess. I guess we're ready. This is so nice. Are you sure you're done experiencing Star Knight? I think so, I think we did everything. I'm quite serious when I say it will make you fall into a deep slumber. 
I guess. Some dreams. Okay, what are we gonna dream about? Kinda low-key ship it. Oh no, why is she sad? Girl, be happy. You're here. Oh once these walls were gray. But you made stars and skies and snow Wow, I'm gonna fuck straight up cry right now. We found a rainbow everywhere. You made a way so Wait, is she really here? Like, this isn't her Rockwood version. That's her. She's real. If you stay right by my side, we'll make it through the night. Oh, it's the tea plow on the ceiling. It's all her planets. So before it's time to leave, would you build a little world with me? Oh, I feel like this is gonna be bad. Something bad's gonna happen. Oh, it's our—it's the toy room world. It's just all the things she shared with us. Once this room was cool. But then I asked the sun to smile again. This is the sweetest thing I've ever seen. Our castle covered the expanse with all the patches, pillows we could hold. And if I and now we're in the flowers. By your side, we'll make it through the night, and I'll never have. I wasn't ready for this. I was not ready. Oh, we woke up. It was all a dream. We gotta go give it to her. We gotta go give it to her. Oh my god, if she's like dead or something, I'm gonna be so sad right now. Oh no, the doctor looks sad. This is not okay. No, 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 no. Oh no, everyone's sad. I'm not clicking anything. This is progressing by- She's gone. Oh, she's got a rainbow above her bed. No, 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 no. No, no. Absolutely not. Wow, this is so not okay. Holy shit. <laughs> oh. It's time for me to leave. I'm glad you built this little world. No. What? Is she, is she dead? Or is she, is she just, no, Yami, I don't want, get out of my life right now. I know you're bad news. They all leave eventually. Yami, I know how you feel. I know what it feels like to have someone leave you. She didn't leave me. You make it sound like she left on purpose. But she didn't. Well, the person who left me did have a choice. How do you know that? Because he had the chance to come home, and he didn't. What if he stayed because people needed his help? Who could be more important than your own family? 
He left us alone. Is Yami Sue? I'm sorry. I know how it feels to be alone. But if you come with me, you'll never have to be alone again. Yami, come with me. I'll take care of you. Okay, uh, whoa, um, excuse me, red flags. I'll go. Oh no! Oh my god. Um. Is my mom sleeping, standing up, or sitting up? First of all. Second of all, what's happening? Things just went off the deep end right now. I think I just got kidnapped. Where's my son? Oh no, did we get to only- Is it mom? Oh, we're mom now. Oh, look, she's awake. Good morning, ma'am. I hope you slept well. Wasn't Starnet a blast? Thank you all, and yes, it was a very lovely event. I'm sorry, I'm just a bit distracted right now. Have any of you seen my son? Your son? Oh, that's right, you two are usually together, aren't you? Yes, but I just woke up and now he's gone. I have a terrible feeling about this. I have to find him. It's okay, ma'am. We'll help you out however we can. What's going on? Someone's lost? Yes, her son's gone missing. Her son? You mean the child with the warrior's hat? That's him. She woke up and he was just gone. That's terrible. I know. I'm sorry, but I have to go now. Ma'am, I know you must be in a great hurry, but if I might make a suggestion? Here in Morizora's Forest, we have a belief that when a loved one has gone missing, a Hikaribana will lead you back to them. A Hikaribana? You mean the glowing flower? Yes. Do you know Winston? He was in town the other day and he mentioned keeping one in his tent. Winston lives out by the river. He might lend you his Hikaribana if you're unable to find your son. Thank you very much. I will go there right away. Oh, and ma'am? Yes? The envoy are strong today, so please be careful. Thank you, I will be. I was gonna say, it looks dark. It must be- Oh god, it's creepy. Oh look, there's one- they're, they're just standing. Did you enjoy Star Night? Oh, where's your cult? Aren't you usually together? Yeah, well... Where's your son? I think this is the first time I've seen you guys apart. Oh no. This morning there were big gray clouds everywhere. Do you think another storm's coming? Um, okay, I have to remember how to get there. I think I go down this way. Fat Lebel, are you okay? That bear thought he could eat more than me, ha! Huh? Buff kiss forever. Okay, I think it's down this way. Mm, oh, no, 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 not this way, never mind. I'm stressed, I'm stressed. Excuse me. It's this way, isn't it? There's lots of different kinds of spirits. Oh God, they're like everywhere. Hi. First of all, I see you have a lot of new friends. Well, hello there, it's been a while. Oh, Winston. I'm sorry to bother you, but I don't know who else to turn to right now. Oh no, what happened? When I woke up after Star Night, my son was gone. Something feels wrong. I don't know how to explain it, but I just know he needs my help. The envoy. The labels at the end told me that a Hikaribana could lead me to him. Come with me. I think I might be able to help. Have you heard the story of the Hikaribana? A little bit. Where I come from, every year, Luna flies lay their eggs inside these big flowers. When they hatch, the Luna flies make the whole flower glow and lift them up as they fly for the first time. But there's something else that's special about these flowers. If you've lost someone dear to you and you think deeply about what they mean to you, the light of the Hikaribana will glow and lead you to them. Please, take this and find your son. Thank you. Oh, and one more thing. 
Yes? You should start where his presence was the strongest. The place he spent the most time recently, perhaps where he spent the most time alone with his thoughts. Good luck. Thank you. Okay. Well, I guess... In the real world? Or, like, in Rockland? Because, like, in the real world, I would say his hospital room. I don't know if this is where we should stop it. I don't know if this is where we're gonna get into the final act. I'm gonna try and find the place first and see what happens. Cause I would say either, I'm gonna take it back to his hotel, or his hotel room, his hospital room. It's locked? Oh God. Okay, we can't. Um. Okay, we can't go back. All right, I'm gonna go around you. Hi, yes, hello. Um, God, there's so many of them. They're just, should probably try heading back to the hospital. Oh, so I was, I was on the right track. Just that one I can't take. So I need to find a door that's open. Wasn't there, was there one in here? No, 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 there's one in uh, the blacksmith. I should probably just gone through the one in Winston's, but I didn't think about it. Oh, this one. It's locked, okay, mm-hmm. Uh, I gotta find the right door, apparently. I don't know if I remember where all the doors are. Excuse me, sorry, excuse me. I'm gonna assume that maybe I was supposed to cut through this one. Ah, yes, here we go. Here's where I was supposed to be. Okay, here we go. There's a lot of water on the floor and no one here. Oh no, things are creepy again. Oh God, they say, why help? I can't move past the water. Okay. Mom, well, I'm scared. What is an x-ray? Oh no. Help. And why am I here? And when the work is done, we'll all get to go home. Oh, we have to help him. Help. Okay, that looks creepy. Um, I'm gonna adjust. Okay, yeah. Oh boy, I think this might be the last act of the game. I think I might I might want to stop. They're here. Enter the portal. Well, let's at least see what's what's in here. But don't you worry. We're a strong bunch. We're eating ramen together and singing fight songs. Oh boy. Han, are you in there? Is someone calling me? Oh, my dad. Just me. Just wanted to let you know I got ahead in early today. Tetsuya called in sick, so they need an extra hand on the floor. Oh, that's too bad. Well, your lunch is all ready. I just gotta grab it from the kitchen. Oh, I can grab it on the way out. You two gonna be okay picking up grandma from the station? I think we should be fine. I'll let you know if we run into any trouble. I just gotta take care of some things around the house before we head out. Alrighty, I'll see you later then. I love you. I love you too. Hmm, now where did I put that to-do list? It's gotta be around here somewhere. Oh boy, I, I think we might need to stop here. I think this is the last act of the game. Like, I theorized that the last person we were gonna have to help was gonna be us. But I didn't expect to be gone and have to do it all as my mom. I think that's- I think we're in the- we're in the last act, so I think the next stream's gonna be the finale. I have the hiccups. I know this one was a little bit shorter, but in the interest of keeping them together, I think we need to stop it here.
I don't know. I just think it's better. Um, and that makes me happier, so I'm going to do that. Um. Alright, I think I'm just gonna end it here. On Friday, we will probably play Stardew. Um, because I know that Michael really wants to play Stardew, so I think we'll do that. Um, and then we'll go from there. But... Okay, wait, 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 I need to save. Uh, before I do anything. Oh god, I'm so stressed. This is not- I wasn't prepared for this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna- I'm gonna stop and go cry for a while. Um, cuz that was not okay with me. Um, honestly. And I really hope we're gonna be able to do something about that, and I look forward to finding out. But we're gonna have to do that next time. Thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate you, and I love you, and I'll see you on Friday. Bye!